Good day, everyone, and welcome back to Daily Devotions. Our Daily Devotion for today, Monday, February the 22nd, comes to us from the Old Testament book of Genesis. We're going to be looking at Genesis chapter 17, verses 1 through 7, and 15 and 16. When Abram was 99 years old, the Lord appeared to Abram and said to him, I am God Almighty. Walk before me and be blameless. And I will make my covenant between me and you and will make you exceedingly numerous. Then Abram fell on his face and God said to him, As for me, this is my covenant with you. You shall be the ancestor of a multitude of nations. No longer shall your name be Abram, but your name shall be Abraham. For I have made you the ancestor of a multitude of nations. I will make you exceedingly fruitful, and I will make nations of you and kings shall come from you. I will establish my covenant between me and you and your offspring after you throughout their generations for an everlasting covenant to be God to you and to your offspring after you. God said to Abraham, as for Sarai, your wife, You shall not call her Sarai, but Sarah shall be her name. I will bless her, and moreover I will give you a son by her. I will bless her, and she shall give rise to nations. Kings of peoples shall come from her. Hey, you. Yes. I'm talking to you. You, who like Abraham, have prayed for God to show up with blessings. You, who have grown too weary to hear any promises of good news. You, who like Abraham, have entertained strangers having no idea that it was God coming to you. To visit. You, who, like Abraham, are lying with your face to the ground, afraid of hearing God's blessing proclaimed to you, lift your face. Hear good news. You don't have to believe it now. Take a minute. You can laugh in disbelief with your partner if you need to. God's promises can sound a bit absurd at times, but they are just as sure as the rising of the sun, for God has called you blessed and beloved. God is on the brink of using you to bless many generations to come through your faithful actions. Trust in the one who has made you, named you, called you, and sent you. Let us pray. God of Abraham, give us faith to trust in the promises that feel unanswered. God of Sarah, give us faith to look into the barrenness of our days and see new life. God of the promise, give us trust to remember that you are good. God of blessing, help us to see your new mercies every morning. Amen. Grace and peace be with you this day and every day. And I look forward forward to seeing you back here tomorrow. Bye now.